today's video is based on the tally integration uh, with ERP next so some of the transactions we have configured that can be fetched from ERP next to tally so I'll show you uh, how it can be done so let's get started this is our tally home screen on the right hand side we have uh, some transactions which are configured that is a fetch ERP next sales transaction sale invoice fetch ERP next purchase that is a purchase invoice fetch ERP next payment and receipt that is a payment entry and receipt entry of sales and purchase and fetch ERP next journal entries fetch ERP next items so uh, let's get started and I'll show you how to fetch the transactions from ERP next to tally so I'll show you first sales invoice how it can be done so let's move to the ERP next sales invoice screen so this is a sales invoice a to z aluminium which is for 236,000 sales invoice is amount and the voucher number is 32 and this is a customer name a to z so if I open this you can see the item name is 2.0 mm wire which is for 2 lakh amount and with GS, GST is 36,000 and with GST the total amount is 2 lakh 36 this invoice is booked on the 1st of July so if I want to fetch on the 1st of July uh, if I'm doing the entries in tally I want to fetch the 1st of July transaction in tally how it can be done so let's say uh, I want to fetch the sale invoice so I'll just click over here I mentioned the date over here for July I'll mention the voucher type with inventory and I say yes so you can see this notepad screen has opened the voucher number 32 has been imported successfully now let's go to the daybook and see so yes over here sales invoice 220032 has been imported successfully so if I open the sales invoice this is item name this is a quantity and this is a amount and this is a GST amount 36,000 so total is 236,000 so this is how we can fetch the ERP next sales invoice to tally so it is very easy to uh, fetch invoices from ERP next to tally so that can be easily done this is manual uh, fetching process I have shown you this can be done it auto scheduler wise also so you don't need to do it manual thing so this is how we can do it so thank you so much for your time